How to recover your Solana wallet to Phantom. Hello people, welcome to this new video. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how we can recover our wallet of Phantom Wallet. So there are two ways that we can do that to recover our Phantom Wallet. So whether you are on your phone or you are on your browser of your computer, it's the same thing. We just need to have the following information. So once you download a Phantom Wallet so you can import your wallet if you want to recover it, I'm going to add it into my browser. What's going to happen is that I'm going to click into I already have a wallet. Or if you already have the Phantom Wallet into your extensions, you need to click where it says recover or import a wallet. So there are two ways that we can do that. What we can do is to create and import an existing wallet with a secret recovery phrase that it was given to us the first time we create our wallet. So this one has from 12 to 24 word secretly recovery phrase. But if you don't have that information, in this case, let me create a new one. So this is the secret recovery phrase that I am watching at the moment. I have to copy this information and paste it the next time I wanted to import this wallet. So I'm going to use this new wallet so I can import another one. So after that, I want to go into my extensions. I'm going to pin the Phantom wallet. I'm going to click in here. I'm going to click into the three arrows that are here and I'm going into add connect wallet. And now the second thing that I want to do is to import my private key. And the private key is like an address, like a very unique address of your wallet that it was given to you actually. So what I did to get this um, secret token is that I went here where it says help and support. And in here I went into my FAQ. I looked for recover. Then I looked for more information. So this is the recovery phrase. Then you just have to click into add connect wallet. I'm going to have to import the private key. It was, it's going to look like this. And after that, how do you get your private key? If you go in here where it says configurations, if you go down here, it says export private key. You have to put your own password. And this is the key that's going to be asked for you guys. So I'm going to go into copy. I'm going to remove the wallet. I'm going to go into add connect wallet connect import private key asw and i'm going to paste my private key and i'm going to import it and there you go guys it was really simple to do it so now keep in mind that any question that you have there's always the faq of phantom wallets so you can receive more information about the situation or the main situation that you're having guys like maybe you were scammed or hacked and what can you do or what can they do to to help you so hopefully this was a very useful video for you guys Thank you for watching the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel if you want to see more about this kind of stuff. And I'll be seeing you guys in the next one.